So it's Friday and I'm just starting to vlog for the weekend and the husband has made a rather fabulous dinner. Um, he made... Okay, tell him what you made. Spicy fish cakes. <laughs> What's in the spicy fish cakes? Haddock, salmon, spices. Uh, mustard seeds, curry leaves, ginger, chilli, potato, egg, yummy, breadcrumbs, yummy. flour. Magic unicorn stuff. Oh, the unicorn is most important. Yes. So we're just about to munch dinner. I'm very spoiled. I just painted my nails. What do you think? Oh, I don't know if it'll focus. Hang on, let me do that. Like this. I'll do the floor. It's not focusing. Hang on, see if it can focus. Focus. There you go. Do you like my nail stamping? I think it's kind of cool. Yeah, I think it's... Oh, there we go. It looks maybe slightly better on this hand. But yeah, so I just did that while Simon made dinner. I'm a bit of a spoiled girl. Yep, for so Simon is not a spoiled, spoiled girl. I watch Cannonball while cooking. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so you had fun. <laughs> okay. We don't talk about him. No. We're going to watch a bit of Netflix while we munch. Excuse all that mess. My niece got playing with stuff. So yes, I'm going to go eat some din -dins. Just nyami nyami. finished taking pictures. The stand is still up. Let's put that away. Um, and yes, I was taking pictures of that stuff. Also, I've been good and taking... Oh dear. Taking pictures of stuff I need to sell on eBay. So I'm selling like boots and stuff. Um, by the time this goes up, they should hopefully be sold. Fingers crossed. Um, I should probably have done this in advance and then told you all I'm selling stuff. Oh. I'll leave a link for my eBay just in case it's not sold because, you know, that would be sensible. Um, so, taking some pictures for blog posts um, and taking. Oh, <laughs> wonky there. Taking pictures of things I have to sell on eBay. It's going to be good. Just finally sorting out some washing because I went to hang it up and it was still a bit damp, which is annoying. So, I've done that. Um, oh, there we go. That's what's wrong. I'm trying to put this away and make a mess of it. Um, what else am I going to say? Yes, all the stuff sorted for British Open. So I've paid for my fish fees, competition fees, which wasn't too bad. But then booked the hotel for the night before. Um, so the competition is on Saturday and Sunday. If I just swap my hands here. The competition is on Saturday and Sunday at the end of October. And I've booked us to go to the hotel on the for Friday night and Saturday night and then coming back on the Sunday. Um, Simon is being good. He's actually coming with me because I'm going on my own. None of my dancers are actually competing this year. So it's just me all by my lonesome. But I'm determined to go because I want to qualify so that I can go to Worlds. Um, but yes, it's cost an absolute fortune now that I've sort of booked everything. Oh, I absolutely stopped recording myself. I realise as well my hands are a bit shaky for some reason. I'm very sorry if the camera's really shaky. But yeah, so paid off and it's going to be a tight month. But just got a virgin bill through. And because it was expensive last month, because we switched this pile of stuff over and we got a new router and all this kind of jazz, we basically we've cut our monthly bill from £56 a month down to 32 because we've cancelled our TV subscription and we've increased our broadband speed, which is excellent. But yes, because I've done that, it meant this month I've only got a bill of £1.20p. Score. So that's going to be good. So I'm not paying like 30 quid this month. <laughs> So, you know, that's that's a good thing. That's uh, another £30. But yes, it just means I have to be sensible this month. I keep meaning, I'm trying to clear up and I'm getting distracted. Um, so yeah, it's good though, it's got to be good. And it means I'm sort of being sensible. And you've seen these shoes on the floor. These, and I've got some clothes there that are hanging up. They are getting organized I've organized I've taken the pictures of them and I'm putting them on eBay because I've had these clothes for ages like those shoes for example I had for a year and I still hadn't got around to putting them on eBay I'd never worn them it's a disgrace well I'd worn them a few times but I don't wear them is the point I'm making so I've taken the pictures and I'm gonna put them on eBay Simon is shooting stuff shooting stuff he's playing destiny and he's playing some sort of player still haven't sorted this mess out this is this is my next declutter mission. I have loads of CDs on there I don't listen to ever, ever, ever. Oh, you can see our scaffolding now at the minute. 
So we have that outside our window. So you never can quite tell how grey it is outside. It's got that blue tinge to it all the time. Um, this is actually, do you remember I said I'd show you the bookcase a bit better? This is what it looks like. It's much tidier. We've got now space to put up the rest of the pictures. And well, that's a nice card from his granny to say thank you for the um, uh, coming to her party. Yeah, and dancing and stuff. Simon, when we went to Hogwarts on the broomstick. Let me see if it'll focus. I have video. Awesome. There we go. Um, jelly beans. That's all that's left of my jelly beans. That's all the recipes for the jelly beans. That's all that's left of my jelly beans. Sad times. Jelly bean recipes. And that's all sort of, that's now more of like an office kind of stuff. I've got uh, pens and random books in there, notebooks. And I've actually got space to put up, oh, that shouldn't be there, that goes there. Uh, space to stack stuff nicely now. Um, there's me on my broomstick. Looking pretty slick. And that's obviously in front of all my Harry Potter books. And then I've got some more comics and stuff there. And my memorabilia from Harry Potter. That's just a notebook with the Gryffindor uh, thing embossed on it. And a bookmark and no, stuff. No, 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 no. This is all, all of our cameras. Which you can't really see. But the, all of our cameras in there. Because we've got a, an SLR on top of all of them. In here are all... We've got film and other random bits that we need for camera stuff more stuff these need to get i have to decide what to do with them i was going to do a blog post about some stuff more pictures a record player more books more books oh i'll stop recording again because i ran out of storage because i have to tidy up but i'm going to go and do stuff and we will catch up in a wee bit okay this is annoying i recorded some video stuff of being outside oh hello to simon we went outside and simon took some pictures and stuff for the blog and video for my beauty channel and I've just went and deleted the damn thing. I thought I was pressing a different button and oh, <sighs> such a muppet. Very annoying. So you know I had some nice outdoory stuff and that's gone. Simon was running circles around me and everything. <sighs> so that's annoying. I'm just now editing um, some beauty videos and getting them exported so I can upload them and I have to go take more pictures but I'm just so annoyed like seriously Simon's annoyed too no he's not he's just upset such a donkey Aww. so yes I had outdoor footage look at just to prove it look at leaves I stole some leaves from the place that we were taking pictures because I'm gonna dry these and put them around um, some candle holders so that I can put more <coughs> candles in them. But yes, very annoying, very sorry. I'll get some more outdoor footage anyway, but it's just very annoying to, to do something so stupid. Yeah, so yes, I have to go take more pictures and get this editing on the show on the road. And I've just noticed in the video, one of my eyebrows has gone wonky. I have the most annoying eyebrows. That they don't, they're just straight. Like that. And I try and shape them a wee bit. And then some of them just be like, nah, I'm just going to go from where you have me to being straight again. It's just very annoying. Anyway, round over. I will catch up later, maybe, or something. Okay, bye. Bye. Hello. Till next time. Goodbye. Good morning. It is Tuesday morning. I'm just on my way to work, so I'm sorry if it's all shaky, but I'm, maybe if I hold it with the other hand. <gasps> Jesus, who knew? Um, yes, Tuesday morning. On my way to work. It's actually a bit of a grey all day. Not particularly cold though, which is good. Um, very exciting news. We have booked our holiday to the Maldives. I know. I'm excited. <laughs> We're going April next year. So that is very, very exciting. It's ridiculous money, like unbelievable money, but we've been saving up and we got money for our wedding. So there's that. We still have like half of it to pay off, actually a bit more than half, but it'll be fine. We'll get it. It'll be worth it. Just means we really have to tighten our belts for the next 
sort of four months, five months. I have to have it paid off by the start of February, so. But yes, so excited, seriously. Um, I'm still grinning today. I woke up this morning grinning because I'm just, I can't believe we've actually booked a holiday that kind of, it's just pure luxury, you know? It's not something we would normally do. So very, very excited. Um, so yes, there's that. That's exciting. Did a bit of training last night. I injured myself a wee bit last week, but it seems to be mostly sorted now. So I did a bit of dancing last night and finally got my hornpipe settled into the music, which is good because, you know, British Opens are in four weeks. So, yeah, doing more training, but I'm trying to not overtrain, like I trained in my in my dance trainers. I'm saying train a lot today there. So I danced in my dance trainers for most of it and then just swapped over to my heavies for a wee bit. Yeah, it's all very exciting. Going jogging later on with my sister-in-law, so it'll be good. Um, I think she's excited as I am about booking it. I had to text her last night to say I'd done it and like phone my parents and stuff. <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous, right? But don't care. But yes, I'm gonna go away on. I have to get to work, so we'll catch up in a wee bit. Hello. Hello, Simon. Say hello, Simon. <laughs> the husband not say hello. Still not say hello. Um, it is Wednesday. <laughs> it's Wednesday, and it's about like half nine. Yeah, it is about half nine. And I'm just sitting watching some of the videos. I did a collab on my beauty channel with I was asked by Jerry from Hello Jerry. Um, to just take part in a collab with a few people for Halloween tutorials and it's just quite fun now watching everybody else's go up and all the different ideas we've had. I'm just sitting here chuckling at everybody. It's quite nice. In a good way because we've all just sort of been laughing as we go along. Um, but yeah, just taking it easy this evening. Um, I was supposed to be going to Pilates this evening but I, because remember I mentioned that injury thing I did on Monday and my legs just being really silly buggers today I suppose because I did Pilates on Tuesday and then I went for a bit of a run yesterday that was a bad idea because I did have to start walking towards the end but you know young and stupid maybe not young but maybe just a bit stupid sometimes um yes just sitting chilling Simon is being very special this evening although he did make me nice hot chocolate hot chocolate yummy 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 in my Hogwarts mug my my lovely Gryffindor mug my face is all playing up. I've not been wearing any makeup this week in the hope that it'll settle down. Maybe it'll settle down. I've been drinking more water and stuff and it's gradually going down. I want to wear more makeup, but thankfully I've washed my makeup brushes, so I actually have clean brushes. Hopefully they'll dry by tomorrow. Oh my god, we're having, because we're having the, what are they doing to the walls? They're blasting it with something. Sandblasting it to clean it. Yeah, so they're sandblasting the walls. So there's dust actually inside our flat at the minute, which is annoying. Even though the windows are all closed, there's like a layer of dust. Is there any on that window though? What do you see? I'll turn it around. Yeah. Look, you can sort of see the dust. Simon's turned on his phone so you can see. Look, this is coming through our windows. So I have to wait till Friday to give it a proper clean. Very frustrating. Quite annoying having that going on at the minute. But our building will look nicer afterwards. Um, what else have we got up to the past few days? Work. Yeah, we'll just be working. There. I was teaching. And I've been good. I'm starting to eat healthier again because we've booked our trip to the Maldives, as I said. And it's quite hard. It's like trying not to eat any sweet things or go to the shop to get anything. But I've been eating salads. I've determined to shift my soft tummy. It's not good. Yes, I'm also going to be resting my foot this weekend, my leg this weekend a wee bit because I want to go to the British Opens at the end of the month. And I need to have working legs for that to happen. It's just so frustrating. I think I need to just not run or jog for the next few weeks. It seems to always end up worse after I've been jogging, unsurprisingly. But maybe keep up Pilates and do blog Pilates or something just to keep that up a bit. I think that's the way forward. Yeah. But yes, that is it for now. We'll try to catch up with you tomorrow. Do something other than in the flat. We all seem to be in the flat sitting on the sofa because it's at the end of the day. It's scary out there. I don't want to go outside. It's a bit boring though, sweetie. No. It is. 
so yes uh, we will do more fun things we're going to see a friend on the weekend so we'll try maybe we're going to go for a walk I'll try and record some outsideness might be nice and my brother and his wife and little person are coming up for movie night on Friday night Simon's excited we're having pizza and Sunday yes. Sunday I'm going to meet my friend she's pregnant so we're going to meet up and have a cup of tea and celebrate that she's pregnant Simon isn't going to come didn't know you were. I told you the other day. Yeah, I he definitely did, told yeah, you. He, did, okay. <sighs> he does this to me. I think I tell him things and then I haven't. And then when I do tell him, he tells me that I haven't. <laughs> Losing my mind. But yeah, just a week catch up for now. And <laughs> we will catch up with you a wee bit later on in the week. Okay, bye for now. Say bye for now. <laughs> so it's Thursday and it's been a really quiet one I've just been watching the vlog back it's pretty quiet I might just trim some of that um but yes quiet one this week we're doing some fun things this weekend we'll take you along and yeah sorry it's a quiet one but I lost some footage as I said and things like that so I'm just gonna round off this week's vlog with okay but thank you for watching and stuff and look at I actually changed my top I realized in some of the videos I keep wearing the same I change into like a t-shirt top thing whenever I get home from work and I was wearing the same one like two evenings or something at the weekend so when I'm not in work I'm just faffing about the house cleaning and tidying or just finished recording videos I switch into a t-shirt yeah it's clean it's fine <laughs> But yeah, so that is it for this week. Thanks a million for watching. Sorry it's so quiet. But you know, I'm sure it'll be more exciting next week. And Simon is... Oh, he stopped laughing hysterically now. He was laughing hysterically in some sort of video. Alright. Uh, and then I lost the power of speech. <laughs> I have ten cats. Oh, okay. Um, he's editing Minions. Being silly. Uh, Keep on Facebook. Thanks, Simon, being silly. Anyway, thanks a million for watching, and we will catch up with you soon. Hope you're having a lovely time wherever you're at. And that is it. Okay, bye.